Hello everyone and welcome back to another video and we are unboxing <gasps> this was a Christmas present first off that I got to open um, a little bit earlier than the rest um everybody said hello to uh, my kitty cat Tiny Tim, he's a Maine Coon and his little bell is loud and he loves attention. But we are going to be unboxing this Christmas present. Um, my mother got it for me and I am absolutely in love with this one. It looks like a Maine Coon and I love it. So this is what the box is and uh, what it looks like. So it has a dachshund and a few little teenies, some I can't really figure out what they are, um, and just that in general. So uh, so I think it might help to just unbox it like this and show you, and then show it with a white background, all the pets. So um, this is what it looks like again, these are back. This is the uh, um, this is the space series. They're all like uh, space out, I guess. Um, I really have no clue. Sorry, I look disgusting, but um, yeah, this is the best way I could think of to. Okay, so first things first, we have the list of all the space ones that you can get, and other ones on the back. So you can get a good amount. I'm pretty sure these are all like in the way they are. And then you have the foodie ones, um, some regular ones, I'd say. The Lucky Dozen. I have a few of those. And then we have uh, some of these ones. These are called the Cosmic Bounce. Cosmic Bounce. Okay. So I'm going to keep this little packaging. Hopefully I can get more. I'd like to go down to the flea market and shop for some. I don't know where my mom found these. I have no clue because I know she just got Christmas presents. So, yeah. Um... Here they are. We're going to go ahead and take out the big ones first. And then I'll show you them. Okay, so this is the first one, and it is a giraffe. Uh, this is actually, um, in, like, honestly, <laughs> this is the first giraffe I've ever owned. And I actually, I actually really like the way they made the giraffe. Um, this, it, this just, it actually looks like a giraffe. It looks cool. Um, though I see how they put the space dots and everything, but I feel like they could have added like more texture to the dots for a giraffe. To be honest, like they could have made like white, like a white pattern or something. That would be cool. If I had ever gotten another giraffe like this, that's something I'd do. But other than that, it looks cute. It looks more like an alien more than it looks like a giraffe, but it looks cute. Um, this one is my favorite, one of my favorites out of it. It's a Maine Coon. And it just, oh my god, it's so cute. Um, I don't like the purple collars, uh, but the eyes are a bit sucking in, but they are sticker eyes. 
And the studs are bumpy. Like, I feel like I can just scrape them off. That's, they really just feel really bumpy. It's not smooth or anything. Feels like if you made a custom and you just splattered paint on them. Actually, I feel like that's exactly what they did is they just splattered paint onto them. Let me try and focus it for y'all. See, it looks like they just put a whole bunch of paint. Like, this is an easy custom to make. I think that's all they did. Um, I still like it though. And he's got short little legs. It's so cute. Next we have is the Dachshund. Um, I like the way they made the new Dachshunds. Also, like, they, they're cute. Oh, they are really cute. Um, and their heads are very easy to turn. Like, it's really good. Now, this blue is actually a little bit lighter-ish, more cyan-ish than what it's showing on here. And it's, and it just, it looks one of my favorite bases for, oh my gosh, the seahorse. Oh my god, the seahorse base looks so cute. Oh my gosh, they did a good job with this. The original one was cute too, but like, I love, I love it. I really do, it's very pretty. Very pretty. So the first teeny we have is supposed to be a ladybug, but it is purple and it does have little dots on it. They is, <laughs> it's, Next we have is a purple kitty. And we all know I love cats, so I think they're just adorable. Either way, it's adorable. Have, I'm pretty sure this is supposed to be a French poodle. Um, sorry for it not focusing like it should be, but it is blue and it is gorgeous. I'm not a big fan of poodles, but it's, it's so little. Like, this is so cute. It's an, I'm pretty sure this is supposed to be an otter. You can definitely tell that I am using a different camera. Let me brighten that up for you. Um, anyway. Here is the otter. It is a very dark purple with blue on the front. And I'm pretty sure it's an otter. It is super cute. And then the special one is this one. This one took a long time to figure out what kind of bird it was. This is um, one of them birds with the flappy beak, I believe, or it's a duck. But I'm pretty sure that's like where they store the fish. Uh, I can't remember what they're called. But I'm pretty sure that's what that is. Not much more to say. It's very interesting though, very interesting. And the special one, which I still can't figure out what kind of animal it is. Um, so we're going to open it and I think what I'll do is instead of having this little sparkle pet, because I do know it's a sparkle pet in here, probably like carry around like my favorite a tiny one in here is probably what I'll do. But it comes with this, it's cool because it's got a key. Um, <gasps> that's how you open it. Okay, okay. Oh my, what is it? Is that a mouse? That's a freaking mouse. Oh my god. And it does feel like the glitter will come off. Yeah, it's coming off, see? So I'm gonna put that somewhere where it's not going to. It's golden. It's like, it's so cute. This is the cutest little mouse I've ever saw. Oh my God, look at the tail. That glitter is coming off. Oh, that glitter is coming off strong. Um, yeah. I'm going to lay him there and put him somewhere safe. Um that's it for this video um i man this is really cool i just feel weird after i make it one of these videos so i'm like there's nothing else to like show or anything but i do like watching on boxing videos and hauls and stuff and i hope that whoever watches enjoyed it um i did think of something though if you're doing a warrior cat series and you want to make some space cats for star clan or something this would be great for doing a star clan warrior 
you know, paint it up and then put like little splotches or something. You know, make your own uh, LPS for Star Clan if you want to do that or something. Because this would be like really cool. Because you know, they got like little stars and these little splotches are supposed to be stars. Like, this would be really good to do with that. Just saying. Um, that's it for this video. If you liked it, please leave a like. Um, subscribe for more. Comment for what else you'd like to see. And that is it. Thank you and bye!